Good morning, Springbrook. It's Monday, November 11th. We hope everyone had a great weekend. I'm Star, and here with me today is Saba, and we're here to bring you the morning announcements. Seniors, did you miss your chance to talk with the Johnston's representative last week? Well, no worries. Johnston's will be back on Thursday and Friday. You will also be able to buy caps and gowns for $30. Attention all students. The SGA will be having their first blood drive of the school year tomorrow. Students 16 and over that would like to donate blood must pick up a form from F309 and turn it in as soon as possible to Miss Abe's house. All students must have permission from their parents in order to donate blood. Don't forget to eat a big breakfast if you're donating. The Glass and Clay Club interest meeting will be held on Tuesday at 12 o'clock during lunch instead of today. All students are welcome. Light refreshments will be served. We will meet in room B104 at 12 o'clock on Tuesday instead of Monday. Come out for a night of entertaining Latin dancing when Springbrook participates in MCPS's 14th annual Latin dance competition. It's taking place on Monday, November 25th from 7 to 9 p.m. in the course in the Music Center at Strathmore. You can buy your tickets in F102. Please come out to the NEC Cluster Concert Thursday, November 14th at 7.15 p.m. Admission is free and open to the public. Come see the Springbrook Choir perform, as well as many special guest choirs from other NEC elementary and middle school. We hope to see you there. All boys who are planning to try out for either JV or varsity basketball teams need to turn in all completed forms to Coach Myers and D107. The deadline is tomorrow. Anyone interested in swimming and diving for Springbrook? There will be a swim and dive parent and athlete meeting tomorrow from 6.30 to 7.30 p.m. in Team Room 2. Spirit Wear will be on sale. Also, please bring your cash or checkbook to pay for your team suit and the Spirit Wear you would like to order. Students scheduled to attend the free Hispanic College Fair on Wednesday, please come to the Career Center today during lunch to see which bus you will be on. Students are required to bring a bag lunch. Please see Ms. Patterson for additional information. Mr. Abrams, with the support of Ms. Manny and Ms. Caputo, led a group of young scientists in a class project. The project was to use the science they learned in IAPS to build a boat that would support two students. The final goal would be to race these boats at the MLK pool to determine a winner. Watch this clip to see your fellow Blue Devils hard at work in using their science skills in real life. Thanks again, Mr. Abrams, for putting together this project. Will a boat made entirely out of cardboard float in water? That's the question 100 students from Springbrook High School set out to answer. They have been learning about force, acceleration, and mass in their integrated and applied physical science class. And to help bring those concepts to life, the students were asked to build a boat big enough for two people entirely out of cardboard and then race that boat the length of a pool without sinking. I wanted to get them away from the classroom setting, away from, uh, you know, your typical, like, just lesson plan and really give them, um, engage them in a project. We've really been focusing on for this year is making science real and taking the quotations out of science. And we want to provide the students with hands-on experiences. And so we felt like the best way to do that was to bring them out here, let them actually test to see if the science that they were applying to their boat actually worked. The outcome? <laughs> Out of a total of 12 boats, three boats successfully completed the race. Our team, we pushed it to the limit. Uh, we worked hard on our boat. Um, we strived, but we came out champions. We won. I, from this experience, learned that um, teamwork is really important and listen, listening to others' opinions is important also. I learned how to build stuff that I never knew I could build, and that was, like, really awesome. Well, from Saba and me, have a great week, Devils.